So today we're going to pick Japanese beetles off our plants because all those little stinkers do is eat our foliage and eat all the blooms and they make horrible holes and everything. If you're going to pick beetles, what do you need? Dishwasher soap and, and water. Right. So we put a little dish soap, dishwashing soap in the bottom. We make it foam. Let me show them the bubbles. So we got a little foam up there that helps keep the, the um, beetles right under the water. And you just put it in a little, con we use a Chobani yogurt container. We are organic gardeners, so we don't spray anything to get rid of them. But they certainly do some damage, don't they? Yeah, they eat these, but... Yeah, so what's the easiest way to get these guys? To dump it in like this. Yep. Boom. You put it in. Yep. Easy. I can't push them in. Yep. Do they bite? No. No. They just kick a little bit. They do. And you know what? They love to drop down. That's their first line of defense is just to turn upside down and fall to the ground. Caught him. Caught him. <laughs> but he didn't He didn't get away, did he? He, he? he didn't know. Nope. So look, we see a couple here mating. So let's put up the, let's put the bucket underneath them. Yeah. Yep. And nope. Go ahead. Here. Here. I'm going to dump them in. Put it underneath. There they go. So that's how we sort of go around and hand pick. Oh, here's one. They love sitting on top of plants. Ready? Put your bucket under. Oh, that tomato plant. I don't know. And in they go. You ready? So here's two. Seeing them drop. Oh, one. Here's another one dropping in. We got another one dropping in. There's another set right here. And we're just going to hand pick them like that. See, look. We got two of them. And we're going to dump them in the soapy water. So let's go around and see if we can find some more. Aren't those pretty? Yeah. I love those. I saw those. <laughs>